Welcome to the Vermont Concerned Citizen channel. We are a patriotic American community, and please consider supporting us on Patreon. Thank you. Come down with your breeches of deer skin and jackets of brown, with your red woolen caps and your moccasins come to the gathering summons of trumpet and drum. Come down with your rifle. Let off McGuire surplus and uh, New Jersey. You can see they got a big stain right up through there. Second pair it's not as pronounced. Got some larger detergent soaking into it. Hopefully I'll let that soak. Give it a good hard scrub in the wash machine. Hopefully that stuff will come out. I mean you know that kind of looks like a shit stain running right down the front of the pants. If it was on the knee, the legs, who the hell would care? Right by your crotch? <laughs> Somebody sees it, it's going to say, What the hell did you do, man? Shit your pants? How the hell did you shit your pants there? It's the second pair. Not as stained as the first. It's a very light. It looks like a rust stain. That one looks more like a water moisture stain, but it's right where they were folded and how they were folded. Something on the side of the box got on them and got them damaged so anyways hopefully some uh, soaking action some scrubbing action in a wash machine heavy scrub or something like that we'll get that stuff out of there but we'll let them sit with some soap for a while and then try them in the wash machine <laughs> well, I'm glad I decided to wash them look how dirty that is my god where are they well that's hot water they definitely uh, <laughs> are dirty. I might wash them a second time. Since I see I, my suds are all dissolved. And those things are dirty. Washing them again. It's on the final spin. I don't know if it's almost done. Rinse complete. Or not. But anyways, then we'll throw them in the dryer. Okay, here's pair of one. You can faintly see the stain. Over here you can see the stain. You see that? But it's not so bad in pair two, which was less. I can see a little bit right there. But on this side, I can't tell. So, you know what? Next time I launder them, I'll just put some stain remover on those parts. And I bet within a couple more washes, that little bit of stain will be completely gone. And I have saved myself some big bucks. There they are in the dryer. We'll see you when you get out. Okay. A little bit there. That side looks pretty much gone. That looks there, but that's just barely less. I don't see anything in here. That's hardly noticeable. I mean, light brings it out. Shut off the light. You can still see it, whatever. But anyways... Got a whole bunch of little dead terrorists all over. Gotta get out a cigarette lighter. Fray these things off. They're all over these things. They're new. I washed them. And I showed you the dirt that came out of them. And the dead terrorists that need to be taken care of. So, anyways, there you go. They're done. Except for the terrorists. They look pretty damn good, you ask me. So, for like 36 bucks, two pairs shipped to the door. How can you beat that? I also want to mention that the knees don't feel reinforced like the woodland BDUs. I can definitely tell. You feel up inside. You don't feel that second layer of reinforcement in there. Maybe they thought in the desert that you weren't going to be crawling on your hands and knees as much? <laughs> it doesn't make any sense or rhyme or reason. Does feel like the inside of the pant area is also reinforced? 
like on woodlands, but oh well. Try and probably keep the weight down. Let the material breathe. You don't sweat to death. You are your first and last line of defense. Keep that powder dry. Be safe and stay armed. Please like, share, subscribe, and don't forget to hit the bell notification for future videos.